Hey guys, hope you're doing good today. This video describes the functionality of the Power Center Designer. The basic ETL process requires extracting data from a source, performing a few transformations on it, and then loading it to the target database. This tool determines how the data is to be read from different sources. What kind of data transformations or cleansing needs to be done? And what tables need to be loaded. So here we'll be importing the sources and targets and implementing the ETL logic. The Power Center Designer assists in the ETL process by creating a mapping. The mapping consists of a source, a few transformations and then the target. We can import various sources and various targets in the designer and create a mapping between them very easily. Once you log in to the designer, you will come across a screen like this. You can see the navigator pane on the left side of the screen. This displays the folder structure of your repository that you're connected to. Within each folder, you can see the targets, sources, mapping transformations and maplets of that repository. You can toggle through the menu to select the source analyzer where you can import the source definitions. It can be a relational data table, XML, a flat file, etc. The target analyzer where you can import the target definition. Then the transformation designer where you can create transformations which can be reused in multiple mappings. The maplet designer where you can create reusable maplets using the sources and targets. The mapping designer where you can create the mappings using source target transformations and maplets. The workspace displays the work that you're creating at the moment. You can add or remove objects from the screen. Informatica automatically arranges your mappings in a readable format for you. All your works output is displayed in the output window at the bottom of the screen. All the notifications, warnings and alerts are displayed here. You can see from here if your mappings are valid or invalid. The save routine can also be seen here. The transformation toolbar at the top shows all the available transformations such as the expression transformation, the aggregator, the lookup, joiner and the router. Hope you get a better idea of the designer once we get to the practical work. Thanks for staying with us. Bye bye.